good morning. You are watching A Day in the Life of the Jordan Michael Tuesday family. And why did we think it'd be fun to do A Day in the Life? We are getting ready to go to Giant Cow right now for the first time this year to uh, join in with the children's ministry. Along with, uh, we've been getting ready to ramp up to do our live show. So all those things usually get hit with some, some difficulties along the way. But today, we want to show you our first time going to a giant cow this year. And we want to share with you some resources that we would like in our lives that you, I think that you would like as well. You know, I think it's important to share with you the resources that we like for our family because they minister to us, we enjoy them, and you might enjoy them too. I thought that was going to be more profound when I said it. So we're here to do Giant Cow, and Giant Cow is just a children's ministry where they do skits and stuff and fun games for kids uh, that would uh, that their parents pay for the kids to come in and, and uh, while they're at their homeschool conventions and different conventions that they go to. And so we get to be part of the entertainment, and in the meantime, tell people about the Jordan Michael Tuesday Show. So I'm going to take you along and show you a little bit about what that's like as we tell you about three really good Christian resources right after this message from our sponsors. We also are doing the Jordan Michael Tuesday Show live, which is where we would actually come to your church if you wanted us to come and do a family night or do something for your kids' church or whatever it might be, where we just entertain with songs and we teach the Word of God and we do skits. So if you're interested in us coming to your church and doing the Jordan Michael Tuesday Show live, then just email us. something. Is that too early? It was early. Hi. You want to pour coffee? I hated the coffee. So the first resource we're going to recommend is Spiritual Slavery, The Spiritual Sonship by Jack Frost. And it's all about becoming uh, sons of God, that when we come into the Lord, we, we uh, learn to not have an orphan heart, but we learn to be sons loved by the Father and being able to uh, receive His love and give His love to others. It's a very freeing book and uh, very it's ministered to me and a lot of my family. So check out uh, Spiritual Slavery and Spiritual Sonship by Jack Frost. So number three is my brother's CD, We Will Not Fear. And I wrote the song on it, Everything in the Temple. Juliana plays the violin. You should check it out, Carl Gessler. We just um, we just came out of Giant Cow uh, uh, for lunch. And uh, it's been a pretty nice day. We have croissants. And how much? Hey, now you got a school fish. Yeah. Mm. It's a good. Our number three recommendation is a book that I really, really um, liked a lot, and it's called Loving the Little Years by Rachel Jankovich. And um, this is really, really encouraging for moms who have a lot of little kids. This is so weird because. The author is this guy's sister, and I had no idea. No, I'm the author. Uh, <laughs> My name is Rachel Jankovic. I wrote Loving the Little Years yeah. and Fit to Burst. I also have a podcast called What Have You That's with my other right. sister. You really do? <laughs> no, oh, my sister Rachel. does. Oh, yes. Yeah, so check out there. I'm Andy Wilson. My sister's Rachel Jankovic. And he's author. He's also an author. And so check out his stuff, Russell Wilson. Wait, wait, wait. No. no you're not Russell, Russell Wilson. Wilson, the quarterback of the Seahawks. That's right. Fantastic yeah, guy. Yeah, check out Russell Great Wilson's guy. stuff. He's an awesome quarterback. Andy Wilson, brother okay. of Rachel Jankovic. And, right. And check out Rachel's work. Check out uh, Mr. Wilson, <laughs> Andy Wilson's stuff. Oh. He knows who I am, clearly. <laughs> so uh, yeah. I would also endorse Eve in Exile. 
Even exact. What's By that? my other sister, Rebecca Merkel. Honestly, my wife is, has been through her book, uh, Loving the Little Years, three times. I've read it twice, uh, and then I've probably read bits and pieces more than that. A lot of stay-at-home moms are like, ah! And then they read her book, and they're like, ah! So, that's <laughs> Fantastic. All right, thanks for doing thanks. it. Thanks. I'm Russell Wilson, Rachel Jankovic, Andy Wilson. That's <laughs> <laughs> that is so weird running into Rachel's brother. We had no idea we were going to, but spur of the moment, that was one of the books we discussed. Juliana loves that book. You got to check it out. Whoa, they have escalators here. That's what I love about convention. Yeah, that was everything I hoped it would be. Now, just elevators. I don't like elevators as much because they get a little claustrophobic. So the third thing we're going to recommend, which I think you'll really enjoy, which I mentioned the other week, is Above Rubies, but it's a magazine for women. You know, I should really have Juliana tell you about this. One second. This is my favorite magazine. It's, it's a magazine that it comes out of Tennessee. Because, um, They're from Australia. Go ahead. This is my favorite magazine. And ha you, have you heard of the Trim Healthy Mama people? They do that. They have a book. Yes, Trim Healthy Mama. It's yeah, really but... good. And uh, they also have this. You it, it, what, no, go ahead. All right. I like this magazine. Right. We both do because I really want my wife to be encouraged. So that's why we yeah. go. You know, just it's encouragement for mothers, and there's not a lot of encouragement for mothers out there, is it? Then tell. I like this magazine. It's been a huge encouragement a huge to me as a mom. Huge encouragement to me as a mom. I really like this. Why? Shut up! I like this magazine because uh, it's so encouraging to me. It always um. If I get discouraged being a mom or get discouraged having a lot of kids in this culture in America, I will pick up these and read them. And women from all over the world write in and they just talk about their different stories and um, super encouraging. And if you ever get back copies, I'm in two of them. And that's, that's one of our top three favorite resources. Three. It's Ben. in the resource room of the uh, homeschool convention. Since we're talking about resources, might as well be in a resource room. So another thing we'd recommend is um, a DVD and it is called... My Lighthouse. My Lighthouse. My Lighthouse. Do you girls like that DVD, My Lighthouse? Yeah! It's an awesome DVD with really pretty colors and Juliana likes it because all the colors are pretty. Uh, you should hear it from her. It's a really pretty DVD. See? It's a great worship CD for kids. Man, you gotta check out that DVD. It's a lot of fun. We'll leave a link in the bottom. All right, for our third recommendation, I'm gonna give to you Adventures in Odyssey. We love Adventures in Odyssey. This is something that I actually sometimes bring with me to work when the customers aren't paying attention, when I'm painting their houses. And this is also something that we love to put on for our kids. They would want to listen to it every time. Adventures in Odyssey, that's our third recommendation. And our third recommendation would be Like It. And that's Focus on the Family Radio Theater. Again, awesome productions for the whole family. Those are our top three recommendations right now. And I hope you can check them out and enjoy them for your family. But we'll wrap it up now after a word from our sponsor. I just wanted to stop and say thank you very much to uh, two people who have um, been monthly donors. They've donated 10 and $12 a month. It really encourages us and helps us feel like people are behind us in this and helps us to be able to make a stronger product and put more time into what we're doing. We've also had uh, several people along the way uh, give one-time donations. So if uh, you'd like to donate, you can go to our website, jordanmichaeltuesday.com. We'll see you next week on the Jordan Michael Tuesday Show.